<clears throat> that was <clears throat> this is very very different. This went from sounding like a. To our stupid reactions, idiots. I'm Corbin. I'm Rick. And you can follow us on Instagram, Instagram Twitter for more juicy content. You put them together, you get so Twitter grab. And or Twitter grab. Cool. A gramster. Uh, <laughs> Instaster. Uh, today we're reacting to a trailer. Sounds like a coffee additive. Uh, of Kaho Na Par Hai. This is Rithik Roshan's debut film. <gasps> Baby Rithik. Uh, it's Rithik's birthday today. Happy birthday to you. <laughs> but I think we reacted to a song from this. Remember? We Recently. Did, uh, like a, In the past two, couple of months. Two months ago, maybe. But where he's baby faced. Yeah, he's baby faced, and we're like, oh, like if you saw him right then, like it wasn't as impressive because we've seen older Rithik. Right. And they didn't let him, they didn't know what he could do. Right. And, uh, but it was like real old looking and it was like a really popular I remember song. this. And that's why he became really popular. This is the trailer for that film. Got it. And it's subbed by one of our subbers? Yes. Awesome. Rithik's debut film, which is translated to Tell Me It's Love, was the most successful Bollywood film of 2000, becoming the highest grosser of the year. Well, that's good for a debut. It's gross. Good grief. It was added to the Limca Book of Records. Limca? Is we it? only know of Guinness. Wow. I love Guinness. Limca Book of Records for the greatest number of awards won by a Bollywood film. A hundred and two? What? Wow. <laughs> Following the release of this film, Rithik became an overnight superstar. His successful debut was termed Rithik Mania by the media. Wow. And it came out in... What year did it say? 2000. Wow. I thought Rithik had to have been around way longer than that. 102 awards. That's a lot of awards. And I don't know what, like, obviously they're not all, like an Oscar or something like that. It could be right. like, it could have won a Kid's Choice Award or something like right. that. I don't know. Uh, so you Gold can... star from third grade teachers. Exactly. Uh, and from the suburb, they said they've watched this movie so many times. It's fun to watch. Uh, the entire soundtrack is great. Uh, if you watch this film, you understand why he became a huge sensation. Written and directed by Rakesh Roshan. His father. His father's the one that got him into the... Yeah, marks the debut of his son. It's like you when you make a film and star Micah. Double role? Who? Rithik. Oh, does he play a double role? I think it just said he's playing two, two roles. Well, let's see. Here we go. Yes, I do remember with that shirt. Yeah, the nipple shirt. 
अगर तुमने रोहित का किस्सा ही खत्म नहीं किया तो मैं तुम्हें पुलिस फोर्स से निकलवा दूंगा रोहित मर चुका है Old trailers make you appreciate how much of an art form it is to make trailers. <laughs> that I feel like I just watched a film. Honestly. That was so freaking weird. Yeah, and I th I think I liked how weird it was. Well, it was definitely it had everything. It was definitely old '90s Bollywood. It and it had no. There was like no rhyme or reason to it at all. Yeah. It was just like... The trailer, oh, we're not saying the film. Yeah, no, 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 no this, the trailer, it's almost like somebody went into the film blind and just chopped up segments of it and taped them all together. I think that's what it was, because obviously since it's an old trailer, 2000s yeah. old for Indian trailers, you can't find a lot of old trailers. Um, you want to hear something crazy so right I'm, now? I'm betting somebody just spliced this, this, this is going to freak you out. You ready for this? Well, In five years... Mm -hmm. Something from the year 2000 will be a quarter of a century old. Yep. Technically, right now, we are closer to the year 2050 than the year 1990. Whoa. That's weird, right? It is. <laughs> anyway, you know what else is happening? What? Your... I can't remember. Shut up. Um, so, yeah, the this... I felt like I honestly watched the <laughs> watched the film because I think it was like a fan made this trailer. I don't think this is an official trailer. I felt like I went on some kind of an acid trip. Yeah, it, it's and just, I liked it. It's just because all the quick cuts. I know it's like Randomly. it's like you're doing ah and then and they start like, stopping and like, who's gonna leave? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I love you. <laughs> <laughs> they're, up, they're up on top of a mountain. <laughs> exactly. They're on the beach. They're on the mountains. They're on a boat. They're in the city. This is this is how. Oh you, this, man! This is how real people do things. Hey. I bet you the movie's not boring. I bet it's not. I bet it's just a non-stop fun fest. It's the reason we have horrific Roshan. Roshan. And the reason I have and his I, underwear on. It's true. Right now. I, uh, how many stars that we know of were overnight sensations? Did that happen to uh, like Ranveer? With his debut? Mm -hmm. It did, didn't it? Because okay. I remember when we talked about his life and I he, feel like we watched it, that video about him. I feel like it used to happen more. Yeah. Right, but it seems obviously there was a like I think this was about as big as a breakthrough debut as anything. Yeah, it was Rithik. Yeah, um, I think people just found pretty. People. Well, it's understandable. The guy's he's a beautiful dancer. You could already see, though they hadn't really utilized him yet. You could see the beauty of his his dancing. Mm -hmm. He's a, he's a beautiful person to look at, both his body and his face. He's just a very attractive man, mm -hmm. um, and and of, of obviously from the beginning as well. He was a, a, a good actor, so um, amazing to, that was, I want to see, if the movie's anything like the trailer, I got to be in the right headspace for it, and I'm in that right headspace right now, I would love to watch that thing. I'd have to hear it from the horse's mouth, because <laughs> it, sometimes with, especially that time in, in Bollywood, the melodramaticness comes mm -hmm. out sometimes. Oh yeah, which uh, I don't like. Yeah, <laughs> but not all the time because you know uh, Dil Chat the High was during that time. Hey, we, do we have this? No. Oh. Mm. I don't right. think. I, honestly, I don't think we have any Rithik. That's a shame. Let me see. Let me see here. We have a Ranveer. I would bet half of our DVD collection is Big B. Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna talk about John. <laughs> As it should be. It's true. Uh, 
Go ahead and read it for me. A young girl meets the doppelganger of her deceased boyfriend. That's the double role. There you go. And now has a chance to find the people who have murdered him with the doppelganger. And they said it's a drama romantic thriller. A drum thrill. It's three hours long. Yes. It's all Bollywood, so of course it's three hours. Drum rom thrill. A drum rom thrill. And rom drum thrill. Wow. How how, drum how drum. big was? <clears throat> excuse me. Rithik Rithik Roshan's father. About five 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 six. I think. Shut up. Uh, like in terms of like, was he as big as Rithik? Your guess is as good as mine. As a director? No idea. Um, because. He directed it, produced it, composed it. So he, he did a lot. Yeah, I'm wondering, anybody else in there we've seen? Oh, well, I'm sure there may be some people we've I'm seen. I'm sure. Don't know there. Well, there well, you go. Well, let us know. Let us know the, the uh, beginning of a Rithic Mania. Happy birthday, Mr. Roshan. Happy birthday. Did we figure out how old he was? 40, 45? Was he part of that? No. No. Uh, how old is... What do you think? 44. I think 46. Hey, you nailed it. <laughs>